Not so far in the vast expanse of the cosmos, a world turns quietly. Whispering from the shadows of its parent star are secrets that stir the imagination of both dreamers and scientists. Only four point to light years away a mere step in cosmic terms lies Proxima Centauri, accompanied by a planet that has emerged as one of the most tantalizing objects of study in modern astronomy, Proxima Centauri b. This is not a faint, an identified speck in the night sky. Rather, it is an enigma, a rocky world orbiting Proxima, the closest star to our sun. Now, as a result of the piercing vision of the James Webb Space Telescope JWST, humanity has glimpsed this alien world in more detail than ever before. The recently unveiled image that left astronomers breathless was not just a photograph, it was a window into another realm, a place that could possibly harbor the essential ingredients for life. Yet questions remain. How was this cosmic image captured? What can this small planet, bathed in the red light of its star, tell us about our place in the universe? Could it have an atmosphere, oceans, or even organisms clinging to survival in a twilight strip between endless day and eternal night? The search for answers may bring us closer to solving one of humanity's oldest mysteries, are we alone in the cosmos? Picture if you will, a dim, ancient star glowing faintly with a ruddy hue against the velvet backdrop of space Proxima Centauri, the red dwarf that gives Proxima be its name. Compared to our sun, it is unassuming, barely a tenth of the sun's mass, but one that will endure for tens of billions of years after our own star has burned out. Around this faint ember, Proxima b whirls in a remarkably tight orbit, completing a year in just 11.7 Earth days shorter than a free trial subscription. At a distance about 20 times closer than Earth is to the Sun, astronomers believe it is tidally locked, meaning one side of the planet is forever scorched in perpetual daylight, while the other lies in endless night. Between these extremes lies a narrow band of twilight, the most promising region for habitability, where conditions may cling precariously to the knife's edge of possibility. What makes Proxima be so captivating is its position in what is known as the habitable zone, the region around a star where conditions could allow liquid water to exist. Neither too hot nor too cold, this Goldilocks zone has always been prime real estate in the search for life. Water, as we know from Earth, is essential for biology, and Proxima b receives a level of stellar energy remarkably similar to Earth's. This straightforward fact raises profound questions. Could alien oceans ripple under crimson skies? Could a protective atmosphere shield fragile organisms from radiation? Or is Proxima b nothing more than a barren shell of rock blasted by its star's violent temper? These questions are not idle speculation, they reflect humanity's fundamental desire to understand whether life thrives beyond Earth. The discovery of Proxima b itself was a triumph of ingenuity. In 2016, astronomers confirmed its presence using the radial velocity method, detecting the faint gravitational tug of the planet as it made its star wobble ever so slightly. That wobble revealed through subtle Doppler shifts in Proxima Centauri's light was the telltale evidence of a world about 1.2 times the mass of Earth orbiting in the habitable zone of our nearest stellar neighbor. The announcement sent ripples through the scientific community and sparked dreams of studying a nearby exoplanet in unprecedented detail. That dream gained extraordinary momentum with the launch of the James Webb Space Telescope in 2021. Stationed a million miles from Earth at the Elta Lagrange point, JWST is the pinnacle of human engineering. Its enormous 6.5-meter mirror, composed of gold-coated hexagonal panels, is exquisitely tuned to detect infrared light the very radiation in which red dwarfs and their planets shine most brightly. Unlike Hubble, Webb can peer through cosmic dust, isolate faint planetary signals, and reveal atmospheric compositions light years away. When it turned its gaze toward Proxima b, the results were astonishing. 
Rather than producing a mere blur of light, JWST captured tantalizing fluctuations in brightness, potential thermal readings, and faint hints that could suggest an atmosphere. Utilizing methods like direct imaging with a coronagraph which blocks a star's overwhelming glare web detected the fragile glow of the planet as it absorbed and reflected its star's energy. For the first time, humanity had achieved its most detailed look yet at a potentially habitable exoplanet. However, despite these milestones, Proxima b remains an enigma. Its orbit within the habitable zone is promising, but Proxima Centauri and other red dwarfs are notoriously volatile. They release intense stellar flares, sudden bursts of ultraviolet and X-ray radiation that could strip atmospheres and sterilize surfaces in mere millions of years. On Earth, we are sheltered by a strong magnetic field and atmosphere. But if Proxima b lacks such defenses, life would face relentless assault. Even if the planet retains an atmosphere, it might be dense and suffocating like Venus's hot and toxic rather than temperate and nurturing. Scientists caution us not to confuse habitable zone with actual habitability. Factors such as magnetic shielding, atmospheric chemistry, geological activity, and planetary mass are equally essential for sustaining life. Water remains the ultimate question. On Earth, oceans are the foundation of biology, and the possibility of water on Proxima b continues to fascinate astronomers. If it exists, water could take many forms, seas on the day side, ice-covered glaciers in perpetual darkness, or hidden reservoirs beneath the crust protected from radiation much like the hypothesized subsurface oceans of Enceladus or Europa. Some climate models suggest that, if Proxima b has an atmosphere, it could redistribute heat between hemispheres, creating a temperate twilight ring along the Terminator zone. Within such an environment, microbial life or even more complex organisms might adapt to the planet's extreme rhythms. Adding to the intrigue, Proxima b resides in a stellar family of profound significance. Proxima Centauri is gravitationally bound to the Alpha Centauri binary, a pair of sun-like stars. Together, they form a trinary system just a short distance away on the galactic map. This system holds immense potential not only for undiscovered planets but also for cultural and scientific significance. The fact that a potentially habitable world circles the closest star to our own is a humbling reminder. Our solar system is not alone as an oasis in the cosmos. If life could emerge around the nearest star, what might that mean for us? Then, perhaps the galaxy is brimming with such worlds. Proxima b is not only a scientific target, it has become an icon. It reflects our deepest hopes and our oldest questions, and it may one day serve as humanity's first interstellar destination. Today's spacecraft cannot carry people to other stars, but bold visions are already taking shape. Breakthrough Starshot, for example, proposes sending tiny robotic probes powered by Earth-based lasers to Proxima Centauri, traveling at nearly one-fifth the speed of light. Such probes could arrive in just over 20 years, within a single human lifetime, sending back close-up images and data. Meanwhile, ground-based next-generation observatories like the extremely large telescope ELT and the 30-meter telescope TMT, both anticipated to start operations within the coming decade will sharpen our view further. They may be capable of identifying surface features, detecting changes in atmospheric chemistry, or even spotting elusive biosignatures, the chemical fingerprints of life. But astronomy is a patient art, a discipline where answers arrive gradually and always introduce new questions. The cosmos reveals its secrets grudgingly, and every discovery opens further mysteries. Now we know that Proxima b exists. It is known to orbit within its star's habitable zone. We have early hints about its atmosphere and conditions. Yet is it alive? Is it a second Earth or another Venus? Does it promise fertile ground for life or warn us about fragility in hostile environments? These concerns remain not because science has failed, but because exploration is never a straight march towards certainty. It's a waltz with the unknown, a patient unfolding of possibilities. 
In this way, Proxima B's greatest gift may not be immediate answers, but rather a reminder of the vast unknown that surrounds us and the thrill of going to the stars to find the truth. Whether it turns out to be a host for life or a barren rock, its very existence ignites something deep within us. It tells us that our excursion into the cosmos has only just begun. The next chapter of cosmic discovery may be closer than we imagine, and our position within the grand story is still unfolding. Looking outward, the universe's scale underscores our own humbleness. The observable universe stretches some 93 billion light years in diameter, yet it represents only the portion whose light has reached us since the Big Bang. Beyond this lies the unobservable universe, possibly infinite, forever concealed by the limits of light speed and cosmic age. This distinction between what we can see and what exists around us reshapes our understanding of reality. Observing the farthest galaxies means looking back in time. The light that reaches us today from those galaxies began its journey more than 13 billion years ago soon after the first stars ignited. Each such glimpse offers a precious clue to the conditions of the early universe, helping us stitch together the tapestry of cosmic evolution. One of the most groundbreaking findings in this quest has been the discovery of exoplanets. Since the first confirmation in the 1990s, thousands have been catalogued ranging from scorching Jupiters hugging their stars to frozen worlds drifting rogue through the dark. Most tantalizing are the Earth-like planets orbiting within habitable zones where liquid water could exist. It has been discovered that planets like Proxima b are not rare but common. With billions of stars in the galaxy, the statistical possibility of life elsewhere grows ever stronger. With telescopes such as JWST and its successors, scientists can study light passing through exoplanetary atmospheres, searching for molecular signatures, water vapor, methane, oxygen that may represent life. Though definitive proof has not yet emerged, each new detection broadens the horizon of possibility. The realization that billions of potentially habitable planets exist within our galaxy alone makes it statistically unlikely that Earth is the only cradle of life. And yet, the mysteries of the universe extend far beyond exoplanets. At the largest scales, galaxies form intricate filaments woven together by gravity, separated by massive voids that span hundreds of millions of light years. These structures reveal a universe shaped by gravity over billions of years structured yet dynamic, a living system still developing. At the core of this cosmic architecture lie to profound mysteries, dark matter and dark energy. Even though it is invisible, dark matter reveals itself through gravity, binding galaxies together and guiding their formation. Dark energy, even more elusive, drives the accelerated expansion of the universe. Together, they make up 95% of the cosmos leaving the matter we see stars, planets, people as a mere 5% of reality. Future missions promise to probe these mysteries further. NASA's Nancy Grace Roman Space Telescope and Europe's Euclid Observatory are designed to map cosmic geometry, measure the effects of dark energy, and peer deeper into space than ever before. New ground-based telescopes, like the ELT in Chile, will provide unparalleled sensitivity capable of detecting subtle shifts in distant planetary atmospheres or capturing images of galaxies at the edge of time. Each advance deepens our understanding and expands the frontier of human knowledge. Yet, for all our progress, the universe remains a vast unknown. And maybe that is its greatest beauty. Proxima B embodies this truth. Whether it is a cradle of life or a barren wasteland, it reminds us that our search is far from over. The cosmos invites us to look outward with patience and humility to embrace mysteries as much as answers and to recognize that our universe-wide story continues unfolding. One faint signal, one distant world, one new discovery at a time. And perhaps one day, when humanity finally develops the technology to cross the interstellar gulf, Proxima b will become our first destination beyond the solar system. Its alien atmosphere and red skies may greet explorers who set foot on its soil centuries from now. Whether they discover a thriving biosphere or a desolate wasteland, the turning point will lie in the journey itself. 
For the true value of Proxima B may not be what it is, but what it represents, a beacon drawing us outward, urging us to keep searching, to keep asking, and to keep reaching for the heavens.